This year, we watched as two familiar faces to Nacogdoches County flashed across the television screens of the entire world. During the Columbia shuttle search and recovery incident, Judge Sue Kennedy and Sheriff Thomas Kurz met a gauntlet of up to 25 video cameras and reporters during five-a-day news conferences. Between relentless press conferences and interviews, our county's top chief executive and top law enforcement officer were hard at work organizing personnel, equipment, and logistics. Working with state and local law enforcement and coordinating with volunteers, they created order out of chaos. When federal officials finally took over, they were amazed and gratified that local authorities had done such a good job. Sue and Thomas will tell you that they did not do this alone. Many volunteers and many other officials with the state, city, university, hospitals, chamber, convention and visitors bureau and more worked as a team. This scene was repeated in neighboring counties all over East Texas as we rose to the occasion. But for our community, our sheriff and our judge were speaking and acting for us. They did an outstanding job and for this, they are the Nacogdoches County Chamber of Commerce Citizens of the Year. Let's take a look at each of these recipients. Susan K. Yaw was born June 6, 1953 in Storm Lake, Iowa and grew up in Lake Park, Iowa, a small farming community near the Minnesota border. Sue's father owned an auto body repair shop and her mother was a homemaker. She is married to William C. Kennedy III. They have a son, Bill, a daughter, Katie, two granddaughters and one grandson. Sue is the oldest of six kids and she describes her childhood as enjoying a safe, open community. Kids could play in the neighborhood, fish, and enjoy the heavy winter snows by sledding, ice skating, and ice fishing. As a teenager, she worked in the fields and tutored youngsters in mathematics. If Sue seems combat ready, it might be her U.S. Army training showing. From 1973 to 76, she worked as a nursing supervisor at the William Beaumont Army Medical Center in El Paso, Texas. Sue was in banking business in Rio Dosa, New Mexico from 1979 to 1982. She arrived in East Texas in the early 1980s and worked in Kilgore and Lufkin for two separate COGS, or councils of government. About a year ago, a sound off caller posed the question, who is Sue Kennedy and when did she blow into town? Well, Sue arrived in Nacogdoches in 1985. In the late 1980s, Sue was the Director of Finance and Economic Research for Nacogdoches County Chamber of Commerce. She worked as Controller and then General Manager for the Nacogdoches Telecommunications Incorporated from 1989 to 1992. She was the Executive Director of the Blood Center East Texas from 1992 to 1997. During this time, she also served on the Chamber Board and was Chairman in 1995-96. Sue became the Director of Liturgy and Worship for Sacred Heart Catholic Church in 1997 and became an instructor in the Permanent Deacon Formation Program in 1998. In January 1999, she was elected the first woman and first Republican County Judge in Nacogdoches, Texas. She was re-elected in 2002. By state statute, she is the county's Emergency Management Director. This answers the question one out-of-state reporter asked during the Columbia incident. What is the county judge doing out here? Sue directed recovery activities in Nacogdoches County from February through April of this year. She serves on many government, economic development, and agricultural boards and received many honors. Sheriff Thomas Kurz is 42 years of age and a lifelong resident of Nacogdoches County. The son of James Thomas and Sarah Kurz, Thomas is the oldest of four children. Sheriff Kurz grew up in the Trawick community and attended Cushing schools and Stephen F. Austin State University before beginning his law enforcement career in 1981. A widower, Thomas recently married the former Miss Cody Bishop, who serves as the administrative assistant to Sheriff J.B. Smith of Smith County, Texas. Sheriff Kurz and his lovely wife, Cody, share five children together, Brian, Craig, Aaron, Allison, and Ashley. A graduate of the East Texas Police Academy, Sheriff Kurz is a career peace officer with over 22 years of law enforcement experience. He worked as a patrolman for both the Tyler Police Department and the Nacogdoches Police Department prior to joining the Nacogdoches County Sheriff's Office in 1990. Thomas then worked his way through the ranks of the Sheriff's Office, having served as patrolman, patrol sergeant, 
CID Lieutenant and Chief Deputy prior to beginning his elected duties in January 2001. Jeff Kurse holds a Master's Peace Officer's License, Advanced Jailer's License, and Law Enforcement Instructor's License. He is also a graduate of the FBI National Academy in Quantico, Virginia, and is a certified accident reconstructionist through Texas A&M University. Thomas has received numerous awards and recognitions throughout his law enforcement career, and he's been recognized with an Outstanding Leadership Award three times since having taken office as sheriff. Most recently, the State Sheriff's Association honored Thomas by naming him Texas Lawman of the Year 2003. Sheriff Kurz is proud of the position he holds and the citizens he represents. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our Citizens of the Year, Sue Kennedy and Thomas Kurz.